Hi and uh, welcome to this uh, statics example. My name is uh, Jon Svenningard. I'm a senior lecturer here at Via University College in Horsens. Um, this example is a very simple statics example which shows um, how to find the reactions in a simply supported beam. Let me try to uh, sketch um, how the system works. We have this uh, straight beam, simply supported here in point A, and simply simply supported here in point B. Furthermore, we have a single point load. Let's call this one F, which has the the size of 10 kilonewtons. Furthermore, we have some distances. Let me just annotate them directly below here. And they, uh, even though it's not uh, in correct scale, they should be the same, 2 meters and 2 meters. To begin with, I'll uh, start to make the free body diagram, which is um, the most important part. It's basically the same system. Um, what I'm doing is just replacing the two supports with arrows. Oh, the last one here got a bit off. This one is named AX, AY, and BY and we still have the load of 10 kilonewtons. The distances are the same, so I won't uh, make them once again. Anyway, um, let's make use of the three equilibrium equations. That means uh, we are going to take a summation of forces in the x-direction, which should be equal to zero, a summation of forces in the y-direction, which should be equal to zero, and then a summation of moments in any point should be equal to zero. That means um, starting with the summation of forces in the x-direction, we're getting the following. We are taking um, positive to the right. That means uh, we have Ax and nothing else. That means Ax is equal to zero. Next, I could uh, make use of the summation of forces in the y direction, but obviously we don't know AY and we don't know BY yet. So um, that would render us two unknowns and um, only one equation. So on the other hand, I'll start with the summation of moments around uh, point A, for instance. So um, summation of moments around point A, and we are taking counterclockwise as positive should be equal to zero. That means uh, we have we have the by times the distance of the two meters. We have um, the ten kilonewtons, which is negative, times the distance of four meters, and that should all be equal to zero. That means uh, we can easily calculate By to be equal to 20 kilonewtons. Next, we'll make use of uh, the last of the three equilibrium equations, which is um, summation of forces in the right direction. That means we have um, Ay, we have By, which we already calculated to be 20 kilonewtons, and we have the minus 10 kilonewtons. That means Ay can be calculated as being minus 10 kilonewtons. The minus indicates that the arrow is actually put on in the opposite direction. This uh, sums up this uh, example in statics. Thank you all for listening.